guys, are you interested in making money on the weekends? I'm talking about somewhere between $100 to $1000 in a month. If you are, this video is for you. In this video, I'm going to be talking about four ways you can make money on the weekend. Yes. Welcome back guys. I am Chavi, the owner of Mrs. Daku Studio, a blog where we talk all about working from home, working remotely and making money online. If you haven't already, do not forget to click the bell icon below and subscribe to our channel. You do not want to miss out on any of those videos that we share about making money online and all the leads that we share for the work at home jobs. In this video, as I said, we are going to be talking about the weekend jobs. So without further ado, let's get started. One of the easiest ways to make money on the weekend is to take the surveys. This is one of the easiest and the most relaxing ways that you'll find on the internet. It is certainly not a job that is it cannot replace your full time income but it is a legitimate way to make at least $100 per survey or less. $100 is kind of the maximum you are going to earn with a survey. So, uh, see brands and businesses need consumer inputs to improve their existing products or launch new products, okay? So, they collaborate with the survey companies in order to get the consumer input and pay you for it. So it's a win-win situation. Business get Businesses and brands get the information they require from you and you get paid. Okay, so this is not a scam. A lot of people don't understand the concept behind why surveys are being paid or why survey company pay you to answer a few questions. But it is a very important thing for businesses and you need to understand that. Okay, so not every survey company is legitimate. I will not say that. But there are a few which you should definitely sign up for if you're interested in this. Okay, so let's, we'll go over a few, um, around five of them. So let's start. So the first one I want you to sign up with is Windale Research. So this is one of the most legitimate survey companies out there and they pay really well. All you have to do is take the survey. So here, this is how their website looks like. You can sign up. And uh, you'll be taking surveys, you, depending upon what kind of survey you are taking, the amount you will earn will differ. So, for example, a political survey may give you uh, $10 or an electronic survey can give you $14. So, depending upon what kind of surveys you are taking, you will be paid. You can redeem it using PayPal. All surveys are worth real cash and not points. So, that's a great uh, opportunity to earn money, actual money and not gift cards. The second one is Pinecone Research. This is also a great company to work with. You can redeem points for cash or prizes. And uh, again, it depends upon what kind of service you have been assigned to and what kind of service you qualify for. Depending on that, you will be paid. Swagbucks is one of my favorite and I have used it personally. I have been able to use it to get Flipkart gift cards and Amazon gift cards. You can also get cash from them. So according to them, they have paid a lot of money to their users. It's completely legit. All you have to do is to take surveys, watch videos, play games, do online shopping and the regular stuff and you'll be paid for it. The dashboard is really user friendly. So once you sign up and log in, you'll understand what you need to do. The next one is inbox dollars. You can scroll down and see what all you have to do in order to make money. So you can take uh, online service. So most online service for money pay you around 50 cents to $5 and takes 3 to 25 minutes to complete. There are some online surveys that pay 10, 20 or even more if you match the demography profile. Again, the same thing, depending upon which type of survey you qualify for, you'll be paid. You can watch videos to get paid for playing games. You can get cash back for online shopping. You get paid to read emails. You can get coupon cash rewards and things like that. Um, so you can sign up here and you get $5 for sign up as a sign up bonus. The next one is Survey Junkie. There, is, there are only good things that I've heard about this. So you can safely sign up with them and get paid for taking surveys. It's very simple. You have to take surveys. You have to build your profile. They'll match you with the survey. They'll email it to you. You can earn rewards and you can get, and you can get paid. The last one is uh, Nielsen Computer and Mobile Panel. So this is how it works. You have to answer their registration questions and sign up with them. You install their software on your mobile device and that's it. They pay you for using internet as a, reg as 
they pay you for using internet as you would do usually basically they are trying to understand the usage of a millennial or a per, or, or, or any user for that matter so you can sign up with them here uh, just one pro tip for anybody who is interested in making money with service create a new email id otherwise you will be bombarded with a lot of mails about taking surveys and you will get irritated so it is best to create an email which is dedicated to surveys the next interesting way of making money on the weekend is to take up delivery jobs so i'm going to talk about uh, three apps that you can use to get those gigs the first one is called doordash so this is how the website looks like it is a delivery service for food so you can find restaurant enter your address and order food so what you have to do is to scroll down and get started here so you can deliver with doordash at any time that you have so you don't have to do that regularly on the weekdays but you can take up only on the weekend so it depends upon how much time you have and how much time you can invest in it so click on get started and you can enter your email and get started uh, and get started with them you have to deliver the food depending upon what orders you get and stuff like that um, you will be working as an independent contractor so you may want to go through the independent contractor agreement as well so you can earn extra money for your goals choose your own hours and you have to freedom to dash anywhere that is near your home work or anywhere in between even if you're in a city that is just visiting you can still earn money with doodash so how much do they pay i googled that and according to the college investor doodash advertises that you will earn somewhere between 15 to 25 dollars an hour most drivers who post videos on youtube claim that they earn between 7 to 10 dollars at least so you can safely assume that you will earn at least 7 to 10 dollars an hour which is good money for the weekend the next one is postmates okay i don't know why it's showing me the capture so you may or may not know postmates it is one of those delivery apps which helps you get food drinks and groceries are available for delivery or to pick up these are all the areas that they work in so if you're outside these areas you may not be able to work with postmates scroll down and click on join the fleet so enter your email address password sign up with them it's free there are no fees or time commitments so you can take home 100% of what you earn every time you complete a delivery you get to work on your own schedule and there are instant deposits for the money that you have earned with postmates click on get started and you have to fill in this once your identity is verified they will mail you a delivery delivery bag and a postmates prepaid card and you can get started so according to penny hoarder once you have signed up have passed the background check and attended an orientation you are free to set your own hours and keep 80% of the delivery fee which starts at dollar 5 postmates says experienced couriers can make up to $25 an hour which is great money just checking in with brightstar if it is an individual sole job and the person works during morning midday and evening the earnings may range between 75 to 100 dollars per day so that's great um i think it also says that drivers who only work to earn extra bucks on the side can make 100 to 150 dollars a week so you can do that as well that's actually the concept of working on a weekend 
The third one is Instacart. Instacart is not a food delivery app, but it is when people want to get groceries delivered to their house. So you will be the one who will be shopping the groceries and delivering it to them. So you can click on become a shopper with them. Give your first name, last name, email, the usual deal and continue to get started. So there are two things that you can do with them. You can either be a full service shopper that is your shopping as well as delivering for that purpose. You need to have an access to cars. You can choose your own hours. You can shop and deliver orders and you will be an independent contractor. The other way of working with them is to become an in-store shopper. You'll be a part-time employee. There's no vehicle requirement. You're flexible. You have flexible schedule and your only job would be to shop and not to deliver the orders. For that, there'll be a different person. The fourth option that you can do is to walk the dog to earn money on the weekends. So Rover is a great platform to find out these dog owners who want sitters for them. So this is how the website looks like. Click on become a sitter and you will come here. According to them, you can make thousand, you can earn up to thousand dollars a month, which is great money for walking dogs. And if you love pets, it is icing on the cake. So you can set your own schedule and prices. You can offer a combination of pet care services. You can also set size, age and other pet preferences that work for you. Uh, according to them, if you also provide dog boarding services, that is care for a dog or a cat overnight in your house, you are bound to make more than 2x than a normal sitter would. You can also offer dog walking, doggy care, dog sitting and drop in services. The more services you offer, the more chances of you earning $1,000 will be. So you can start creating your profile by clicking here. All you have to do is click your profile, accept request, and then you get paid for it. So that is it for today. These are the four ways that you can make money online on the weekend. If you're not interested in any one of them, and if you're looking for more options, you can check out my latest blog post on 23 plus weekend jobs that can help you earn $1,000 or more in a month. I'm also going to be linking, in the, link, linking to this blog post in the description box below so you can check it out from there. I'm also going to link to all the things that I have discussed today in the video in the description box below. So be sure to check it out. If you like the videos and if they're helping you out, do not forget to click on the bell icon below and subscribe to our channel. Please also share it with your friends and family, all the people who, would, who you think this video can help. If there is anything specific that you want me to talk about, I would love to do it. You can comment below or connect with me on my Facebook group, Be Your Own Boss and Quit 9 to 5. Thank you.